are we doing tonight? Some of you don't know me. I tried to meet as many people as I could, make it simple. My name is Douglas Graves. It's Doug if we're friends, and if we're not, what the hell are you doing here? You know, I saw you guys about a year ago. You was tiny. I came and check on you because I do some business on the west side. I come and see you here. I come back and look at this place. It's like the Taj freaking Mahal. Well freaking done, I say. I bet you can hang dancing girls from up there. Really? That's an amazing thought. You should try that. Okay, so here's the thing. Since I met you guys, I've been looking at theater a little differently. You know, it doesn't matter if it's low class theater or high class theater. You go to the movies, that's low class. Me, I like guys and dolls. Marlon Brando, may he rest in peace. You know, it doesn't matter, but I go to the big screen. I see a guy, he's got a dame on his arm. He goes, watches the big screen. He watches the big screen. He's got a phone in his hand, something else in his pocket. He's got three screens. He misses the whole movie, and the girl eats his popcorn and still goes home hungry. It's a sad thing. The way I look at it, there's something wrong with that. The way I look at it, you know, I went to the opera. I know this, uh, this broad, she's German, I don't judge. So I meet, this, I meet this German broad, she says, let's go to the opera. I go to the opera. I figured it'd be nice to get dressed up, put on my suit, put the girl on my arm, go out there. Go to the bar, get a martini before we start. You know what happens? Can you imagine what happens? I see a guy sitting at the bar drinking a beer in shorts and a freaking tank top at the Dallas Opera. I look at him and I said, what the heck is that? He looks at me and goes, hey, this is casual elegance. I said, you freaking gumbo. That woman up there, she spent her life casually learning to sing for you. The least you could do is go and put a pair of freaking pants on. Off you go. Point being, I don't have to tell you this, you already know this. You guys got class, all I have to do is tell you to dress up, you show up. Bravo to you for that, that's nice. I like that. Go ahead, clap for yourself, you know what I mean? I go around, I see people, they ask me, they say, why am I not a big man on Mulberry Street? I say, you don't spend any time in your neighborhood. You guys make a neighborhood here every week. I know what you call it each and every week, but just for Doug, just for tonight, can we call it the speakeasy stage? Well, then normally we need a time machine, but I think we're already there. Boom. Welcome. 